welcome to Atlanta Hawks basketball on Fox Sports Southeast tonight. And we are in New York City. Is there a more exciting place on this planet than Christmas time? I think not. The city is alive. Everybody in a great mood and ready for basketball as the Atlanta Hawks get set to take on the New York Knicks here at Madison Square Garden. A very pleasant good evening, everybody, wherever you may be. Bob Rath and Dominique Wilkins with you. This, of course, is the building where Lynn Sanity was born when Jeremy Lynn was a member of the New York Knicks. And against the Wizards on Tuesday night back at Atlanta, Neek, Jeremy Lynn gave Hawks fans a little taste of what Lynn Sanity was all about. Coming down the stretch, Jeremy took over the ball game and actually won it for the Hawks with the way he played down the stretch. And I'll tell you this, when he gets it going in the pick and roll game, as he did with Dwayne Dedman the other night, he is one tough guy to stop. Well, he really is, and what really sets up his drives is the pick and roll. You see Dedman there, nice pick and roll, but he explodes right here, right all the way to the basket and get the layup. And here's another similar play where the pick and roll, but yes, he used a little bit of that creativity instead of blowing to the basket, going the opposite direction, goes down the middle of the lane to get a nice left-handed layup. And then if there was another pick and roll where he just used again his creativity, two crossovers between his legs, leaves the defense standing, steps back, knocks down a nice little rhythm jump shot. These three plays was incredible. Really got the Hawks going down the stretch, and I thought those plays won the game for the Hawks. And Jeremy Lin is in there trying to restore some order here. And the Hawks need somebody to pick it up offensively. Baysmore had those first five points. Bembry is trying to fill that role. Back-to-back -back threes for DeAndre Bembry. He progresses through his rookie campaign. Jeremy Lin drives it and lays it home. Well, again, Jeremy Lin, the very intelligent ball player. He knows where his advantages are. No, no one in the game for New York who can block his shot because no one's at the rim. That's going to challenge. Can't Lynn right there to come up with the board. Taking a shot. That too is no party. Conley for three. Collins looking for the long lead. Noah couldn't stop it. Bemery going for the steal and nice little crossover by Knox to free himself up. That was a wide open shot. A little runner by Jeremy is good. Jeremy is so cagey. I mean, he's a very crafty point guard. By seven. Hillakina with a bounce to the corner. Timmy. Rebound Lamb. Deep post up for Alex Lamb. You make the cover of Time magazine. <laughs> That's saying something. That's big time. Yeah, I'm wondering, I'm wondering when uh, when our cover is coming out of GQ. Well, you know, I've been, you know, probably next year. You know, I've been. GQ and been on the inside. And that was coming off the bench. And then he moved in to start, and Katie barred the door. My goodness. 36 24. Alex Lynn. And goes right into the chest of Thomas to score. Five seconds. Four. Three. Two. Jeremy up off the glass and good at point five. Tim Hardaway Jr. off the bounce. Rebound to the corner. Jeremy's got it with eight. Down the contest. A minute to go in the third. Moody a driving. Collins rebounding. That was good defense by Jeremy Lynn. Stay with Moody a step for step. Challenge the shot. Got him to shoot it a little wide. Jeremy with a left hand. Collins couldn't follow it. Rebound New York and Courtney Lee. Whoops, it's off Moody out of bounds. Career with the Cougars for two years after playing two years at Oregon. Jeremy. Yes. Easy does it. Jeremy Lynn with nine. And the next lead has been reduced to three. And a foul coming on Courtney Lee. And Jeremy Lynn is trying to get the ball on the three-point shot. He said a foul came before. Kevin Knox is going to come in. And Nick fans everywhere looking to see, can this 19-year-old get it going like he did for David Fisdale in the first quarter? Then 
stretches and lays it in. Double figures for Jeremy. To the corner, Bazemore for three. At the side of the glass. Five on the shot clock, going up, Bays on the reverse, scores it. And a technical foul has been charged. All right, that's going to be on Kent Bazemore. Oh, man. He got the lay-in for 16. And I think it may have been his reaction after he scored that warranted the tee, and that's his seventh this season. Boutier to shoot it. Well, just the loose ball the Hawks continue to come up with. That's just a nice pass and finish there by Kent Bazemore. And he was not happy he didn't get a call. 15.8, seven point lead. Moutier missing. Collins grabs another rebound, his 16th. And the Hawks are gonna leave the garden in the winner's circle. Nice job, Atlanta, down nine at the half. Lloyd Pierce and the men come roaring back and get the win. His good friend David Fisdale comes down to offer congratulations as Atlanta gets the first and three against New York this year, and they do it at the Garden, and they do it impressively. Team points and 14 rebounds. Oh, he just keeps fouling up the stats. Just doing the heck of a job.